What's up guys, it's Colin. Today's video is gonna be all about how do I know if my ceramic heat emitter or deep heat projector is on and working. So for the ceramic, we can't visually tell that it's working because there's no visible filament with the fixture. So what I like to do is have it plugged into the appropriate fixture. And there's several ways we can do this. So we'll make sure it's in the on position. I'm gonna let this sit for a second. So first off, if the fixture's been running for quite a bit of time, generally you're gonna be able to feel with the outside edge of the hand that the fixture is warming up. But if I put my hand kind of like in front of it or wave it in front of it, don't touch it. But if I just take the back of my hand and loft it in front of an uh, inch or so away, I can feel a little bit of a heat coming off, kind of like from a toaster. If you're really concerned about burning yourself accidentally, grab your heat gun. And as you can see here, it's already at 138 degrees. So it's warming up quite nicely. So obviously that's not room temperature, so we know that it's on and working. For the DP projector, it's gonna work the exact same. However, with the DP projector, if you have the lights off in the room and the room is very dark, you can sometimes see a reddish orange glow off the filament located inside. It'll look like kind of like the coils on the inside of a toaster. But that is one way to check as well, but obviously always be careful. Um, if you know a fixture's hot, you know, make sure to, to turn it off, let, let it cool down before, you know, adjusting or anything like that. And if you're unsure, just grab your temp gun, much safer overall than trying to touch it. Otherwise you don't want to end up with burned hands.